Oh, what's up people, Dobbs Wolves right here and welcome to another Yu-Gi-Oh! pack opening and today we are opening up something that is over five years old. I picked this up in Japan, freaking cheap people, I paid 2,500 yen for this and this is the Dimension Box Limited Edition and it's the 20th anniversary one from Arc V. It comes with a pack of sleeves, looks like a deck box, four promo cards and there must be some other goodies in here. I'm excited to see this, people, so without further ado, let's try and open this up as safely we can without damaging the box, because to be honest, I would really love to keep this box in pristine condition. So I'm going to go ahead and pierce the cellophane off the side. Here we are. That's good. Thank you very much, Palkia. You're actually a very, very good pin, to be honest. Let's crack it open. Oh. It looks like there is more stuff on the sides. Okay, so we have to go ahead and pierce all the sides. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, get this done as well. Okay, that's that side. Let's do the next side. So yeah, people, this thing has been sealed for five years. And I think the clerk, the person who I bought it off, must have not noticed it on how expensive this thing is. So I paid around about 12 quid for this box, just a little bit over 12 pounds. This thing sells on eBay for 40 to 50 pounds easily. So more likely I should keep this thing sealed, but I really want to see it with my own eyes and see what else is in here. So here is the first thing we're going to see first, just so we have ourselves our special promo cards here. I am actually going to keep the cellophane, you know, all the plastic and everything, because I like the look of the box. But these look like extra holo rares, or extra, extra ultra rares, or they're like, they pretty much, in England, we call them platinum rares. So they are quite lovely. A lot, a lot of people do not like this rarity, but I think it's nice to have the um, lovely, shiny platinum borders. So we got ourselves the Rebellion Dragon. That's nice. Then we have the uh, Clear Ring Rebellion Dragon, I think. I'm not 100% sure if I have butchering the word, the names or anything. And then we have ourselves um, Pendulum Dragon. Lovely. So I might try and find the price for these cards. I'm not sure where to find them, but we'll give it a good go. Uh, so we get ourselves a pack of sleeves. These are the Arc V cap sleeves. I think these sleeves alone are worth quite a bit of money, so possibly I'll be keeping these sealed, or I will use them in an actual professional deck, but I've not decided yet. When I should put them to the side. We have a beautiful deck box as well, people. Look at this, this is nice. Is there anything inside? Nothing's inside, so pretty much it's good to keep your cards in there in pristine condition if you really want to. It looks like you get yourself a deck, and right underneath looks like you can get yourself some deck boxes. Oh, you get three deck boxes, people, so that's nice. I'm actually going to keep these sealed, because like I said, I like to keep things in pristine condition. So I'm going to go ahead and put the deck box and the pack of sleeves back inside this box. And I'm actually going to keep these sealed away forever and ever and ever. <laughs> so let's go put this, the plastic back in. Let, let's literally, people, the, the, the pack of sleeves is more likely worth £12 anyway. So, yeah. I've got the wrong way around. There we go. There we go. And I'll go ahead and put that to the side because I'm actually going to keep that. That's actually a really, really cool box. So you get yourself this deck of cards. I have no idea what consists of this deck at all. I may have watched a YouTube video of Cyber Knight open this box a long time ago, but don't remember it. But right from the get-go, you get yourself a Platinum Rare Starving Venom Dragon, which is lovely. Oh, these are all going to be holographic. Oh, baby. Oh, they are all shiny. So this is definitely going to be a special deck. So let's have a look, you people. So we got an Ultra Rare right here. Okay, okay. Ooh, very good card, Predator Plants. We've got the Rift. So we've got Super Rares and some Ultras in here. 
Okay, okay, this is a weird ass deck, I'll give it that. Winter wound up. Oh, the X, there's the XC card. Super Heavy Samurai's, okay. Okay, a very interesting deck. Fight for patchwork. That's, uh, is that PP Res? Triple D's. Radiant Rings, okay. This is quite interesting deck. This must like consist of all the best cards from all these characters' decks. Wow. Okay. That's Photon. All right. Okay. That is such an interesting deck. Um, more likely, it's not a deck by the look of it. It looks like it's all the best cards from Pacific characters. From the anime series for the 20th anniversary. Um, is it really worth it? Um, definitely for the people who want to have the collection of cards and everything. But like I said, every single card has like a glossy hollow rare in it. Uh, more likely these are the glossies. So the ones that are like are holographics, you got this one here. Then you have another one here. Uh, another one, another one, another one, another one. Another one, another one, another one. Another one. Excuse me. Excuse me. And all these hollows here. So these are all like the like reverse mosaic rare cards. And these are all like mosaic ultra rare. So you get quite a lot of them, people. Quite a lot of them. Definitely worth way more than 12 quid that I paid for. I definitely believe this is worth over 50 quid's worth. I'm not 100% certain. But it is nice to have in my collection. <laughs> definitely going to put them up folder binder just so they can just be there and be 100% um, 100% pristine condition so people can have a look at them so they have an idea what got released back in the day so yeah if you guys enjoyed this little box um, what do you guys think of it is it a waste of money is it uh, quite useless tell me what you think um, possibly some of you guys may actually want some of these cards of course some of you guys do in Geek Retreat I always keep an eye on you guys but yeah, those these cards are definitely not going to be for sale unless I do have quite a lot of these dupe doubles in my actual binders and everything. But we'll find out when I do put them in the binders when I do it off my when I'm doing it on my own. Anyhow, make sure you leave a like, subscribe, comment down below. Remember, people, we're trying to get to thirty thousand subscribers this year. If you guys can get that done, I would absolutely love you guys to death, people, definitely. Because if you guys get that done, I'll be shaving every part of my body bald. Yes, I'll be shaving all my hair off and donating it all to charity for cancer patients. So if you guys want to see that happen, make sure you do subscribe. It helps out a lot of people and myself. With that being said, the people have to go see you guys subscribing. And I'll see you guys next time. Cheerio! Oh, I like the look at this. 12 quid. Wasn't a waste of money. I'm happy I opened it. I like getting these, these are nice. I don't have a clue what the values are, but I'm sure they'll pop up right now.